Hi, in this video, I'm going to show you how to install this mini camera into the birdhouse. Also, the bird feeder. The camera is waterproof, so there's no problem for the camera working in a different kind of situation, even outdoor. Now, the camera has been hooked up to the Wi Fi. I can access the camera on my mobile phone to see in the live video. Let's just go ahead, start from the birdhouse. First, we need to attach the bracket to the roof of the birdhouse. If the box you have is quite large, like the own box or the Buddha box, you also can install the camera at the rear of the box. Okay, I'm going to put it on the roof. Now I need screw, also the screw drive. Okay, we got another one. First, we need to fasten this bracket. You still can rotate a little bit after we install the camera. Now, I just need to attach the bracket, attach the camera to the bracket. You can see there's some hold on the both sides, which allows to attach the camera to the bracket. Oh. Just finish one side, also I have the other side. You need to have the screw install property. All right, now I'm going to wire the cable through the let out notch. There's still one more thing we need to do before we complete the setup. We need to adjust the lens of the camera. You see, the distance between the camera and the bottom of the bird house is quite short. So the focus will become very sensitive. Most of the case, you don't, you don't have the right focus. Well, I'm going to record the video so you can see how I make the adjustment. This is the live video from the camera. You can see the image is fuzzy. The reason is because the camera, the lens is not on the right focus. Now I will take off the front cover. So I can adjust the lens. When we adjust the lens, just make sure your hand doesn't touch the surface of the lens to make the lens get dirty. All right, now let's just move to the bird feeder. This is the place to decide for the mini camera. All right, I also need to attach the bracket. So this must be the right direction. Also, the opposite side. Now I'm going to attach the camera to the bird feeder. Just make sure the shooting angle is as shooting down to the bottom of the feeder because we want to monitor the pan of the feeder, not the roof. Now let's go to the mobile phone and see the live video. I'm going to record a piece of video clip so you can see by yourself. 
Now this is the live from the feeder. I'm going to use it in my hand. And I think the angle is right. If the focus is not correct, you also can just take off the front cover and adjust the focus. All right, that's pretty much all for today's video. If you have any question, you can post it in the comment section below. See you next time.